Australia and the UK have a strong trade and investment relationship. Now, it's not a historic or traditional relationship, but very much a contemporary and growing one. About 22% of the UK's foreign direct investment offshore goes to Australia. And over the last three years, the UK was the second biggest growing investor in Australia, remaining our second biggest investor. That investment stretches right across industry sectors, whether it's Balfour Beatty, uh, recently saying that they would like Australia to be their third home. The University superannuation scheme, investing in projects like the airport link in Brisbane. Or software company like Huddle, recently saying that they saw Australia as a jumping off point for Southeast Asia. Right across the industry sectors, people from the UK, businesses from the UK are involved in investment and trade in Australia. Behind me is the Sydney Harbour Bridge today. 160,000 vehicles go across that bridge every day, and I would think about 8,000 of them have someone in the vehicle born in the UK, because one in 20 people in Australia were born in the UK. And that's just one of the reasons that we're so close in trade and in investment in all forms of business. The Australian Trade Commission in London is here to assist British firms who would like to invest in Australia. And if you would like more information about that, you can speak to us at the Australian High Commission at the contact details on this website.